Hi everyone, welcome back to the kitchen. And today in honor of fall and Halloween's coming up, I have this delicious peanut butter s'mores brownie pizza. I wanna share with you, I'll be doing a collaboration with my friend Inez from the I How Inez Rolls channel. And she's gonna also be making some delicious Halloween treats this week. And I hope that you'll stay tuned to see how this all comes together. Today we're going to be doing a Halloween collaboration with my friend Inez from her channel How Inez Rolls. Now if you guys aren't familiar with her and her lovely family, I'm going to leave a link down below and on the screen I'm going to put a shot of her channel page. She is good friends with my friends Danny and Tina from the Phillips Bam Bam channel and when she reached out to me and asked if I would do a collab with her I was so thrilled to be able to do that so we decided on Halloween as our theme and she's gonna be making some Halloween treats on her channel and later on in the video I'm gonna put a little insert of what she's gonna be doing to kind of entice you to go over there and check her out but I'm gonna be making this really delicious peanut butter s'mores brownie pizza. We're gonna be making it in a deep dish pizza pan and we're going to put all the flavors of s'mores in here and it's gonna be absolutely delicious. We're gonna make this super easy and we're gonna start with our favorite brownie mix. You guys have seen me use Duncan Hines brownie mix. This is the, um, the, chewy, the chewy fudge brownie mix and that's what we're gonna be starting with today. We're gonna mix up the brownie batter as instructed on the box for chewy fudge brownies. That includes two eggs, a half a cup of vegetable oil, and a quarter of a cup of water. We're gonna top everything off in a little bit of a different way. We're going to add, I have some cut up mini peanut butter cups here. I just cut them in half. So I just bought an eight ounce bag. There were 16 of them in there and I just cut them up. I have a half a cup of uh, peanut butter candies and then I have a half a cup of mini chocolate chips. But we're also gonna top this off with some marshmallows. And because it's a s'mores pizza, we're gonna be adding some graham cereal squares in place of graham crackers. Now, if you wanna use uh, broken up graham crackers, go for it. I think you can actually get little mini graham squares now. Um, you can use those as well. But we're gonna use as many as it takes to cover the top of our pizza. I'm gonna go ahead and mix up my, my brownie batter and I'll be right back. Okay, I went ahead and I mixed up our brownie batter just with the mix and the recommended amount of oil, water, and eggs. Now what I have here is a 10 inch deep dish pizza pan and it's a spring form version, but I got them at Michael's. I'll leave a link down below to something similar if I can find it for you. And then you can grab one for yourself. These are really great to have on hand when you wanna do a deep dish pie because you can do this in a regular pizza pan. You just have to have one big enough to where it's not gonna spread too much. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go ahead and sprinkle the peanut butter cups around the brownie batter, and you just wanna make sure that you put this in there as evenly as possible. I also have some mini chocolate chips. I think that's enough. I've used approximately a quarter of a cup. And then I have some of these peanut butter hard shell candies. You guys know what these are. Now we're gonna pop this in a 350 oven for 20 to 25 minutes. So I'll be back when this is ready. Remember, we're putting this in the oven at 350 for approximately 20 to 25 minutes. It may not take as long as a nine by 13 pan because we've spread it out thinner. So set your timer for 20 minutes and check it then. Our brownie pizza base just came out of the oven and we're ready to move on with the s'mores part, right? Because we have the brownie part, we've got the peanut butter part, and I did say this was a peanut butter s'mores brownie pizza. Now we have to do the s'mores part. So that's where these graham cereal squares come in. I'm going to go ahead and pop these right on the top. And then the marshmallows. There's Marshmallows are just gonna kind of hold this all together. Now I have turned my oven off, but I'm gonna pop this back in my oven for five minutes just to set everything together. And then we're gonna let this cool completely and I'll bring you back when it's time to serve up a piece of this delicious peanut butter s'mores brownie pizza. Well, there you have it. 
our peanut butter s'mores brownie pizza is ready to go. It has been sitting cooling on the stove this afternoon and it's time to cut it and try it. It it's sliced up really nicely. The marshmallows are a bit sticky, so I will warn you, you may wanna do the hot water on the knife thing and then wipe it before you slice it because the marshmallows are totally going to stick. So, do you wanna give it a taste? I have to. You have to. It just looks amazing. Look at that. Yeah. Look at that. It's like cheese. <laughs> What is it about the pull of marshmallows or cheese? Absolutely. How could it not be, right? Uh -huh. Brownie, peanut butter, marshmallows, graham crackers, peanut butter cups. I mean, come on. You know it's going to be good. Be sure and go over to How Inez Rolls. She's going to be making some delicious Halloween treats. So I think that's going to be a lot of fun. So be sure and go down below. I'll leave a link to Inez's channel and you can go check her out, watch her Halloween video for this collaboration and be sure and hit that subscribe button because I know she's going to totally appreciate it and you're going to really enjoy her channel, I promise. If you like today's video, please be sure and hit the thumbs up button. And if you are new to my kitchen, welcome. If you've come over from Inez's channel, welcome thank you for watching I hope you like what you saw please be sure and hit that subscribe button and as always if you are a tried and true member of the Noreen's Kitchen family be sure and hit that bell notification button because we don't want any of you to miss out on all the real food for real people real easy recipes that we present all the time right here on our YouTube channel and straight from our kitchen I hope you give this peanut butter s'mores brownie pizza a try sometime soon and I hope you love it I hope that you go check out Inez's channel and I hope you love it and until next time I'll see ya